Police are continuing the search for a missing Columbia mother, and they say that search is going to come out well below budget. ABC 17, Sydney Olson is live at Columbia Police Department after taking an in-depth look at the cost of that search. Sydney, police recently actually built a levee in the river where they believe Munchie G's remains are. Today, I sat down with Columbia Police Chief Jeff Jones to take an in-depth look at the cost of the search using that levee in the Lamine River near Boonville. So far, the department has only spent around half of what was approved for the search. Columbia and Boone County have agreed to split the cost of using the levy to find Meng Shiji, and the total budget for the project is $50,000. As of May 18th, the department has spent just below $25,000, and Chief Jones says he doesn't expect to spend much more. We try to budget for the worst case, uh, which would have included higher water levels, and since the water levels were lower and we were able to project that, we were able to use less material in the river. The nonprofit group Missing Person Support Center has raised $10,000 for the levy project, which will be subtracted from the cost for the city and county. Jones says a majority of the cost for the search has come from paying for rock to build the levy, hotel rooms for divers from other parts of the state, and feeding team members working on the search. Crews are preparing to start the second phase of the project where they will excavate rock they put into the river to build the levee and part of the river bottom, and Jones is hopeful they will find Xi during that process. He said even though $50,000 is a lot of money to be approved for a search, it is done on a case-by-case -case basis and said if they are able to find her in the short term, it would be less expensive in the long run than investigative costs over months or years. He equated the search for Xi to a search in the Columbia Landfill Police did last year to find Megan Schultz, who had been missing since 2006. We have a very strong suspicion based on articulable evidence that this is where Meng Chi is, and we have to pursue it the same way, way that we did Megan. The search for Xi has been temporarily suspended because of inclement weather and because several sanitation workers were exposed to COVID-19 and are now being forced to quarantine, which has reduced the workforce. Reporting live in Columbia, Sydney Olson, ABC 17 News. Chief Jones says once they resume the search at the river, he expects the next phase to take between three and about four days.